Assalamualaikum, hi everyone. Today we continue our lesson about natural water cycle. Okay, so we will start with water from the sea here. Alright, the water from the sea here will change into water vapor, and then the water vapor is cool and become water droplet to form the cloud. Okay, it will form a cloud like this one. After that, the cloud become heavy and falls as a rain. Okay, it will fall as a rain, and then the rains flow back into rivers and sea. Okay, the rains. Uh, flow back into river and sea. So for conclusion here, the natural water cycle is continuous cycle that supply water for living things and to cool down the earth. Okay, the natural water cycle is continuous cycle that supply water to living things and to cool down the earth. Maksud dia uh, kitar air secara semula jadi ini dia adalah kitar yang secara berterusan untuk membekalkan air kepada Hidupan dan untuk cool down the earth untuk menunjukkan kita punya bumi. Okay, now let's move for the second subtopic A. A is around us. A is also present in water and soil. A consists of gases such as oxygen and carbon dioxide. So oxygen is needed for living things for breath. So for example, human breath. Okay, human breath, and also plant breath, and animals breath. Alright, and animals breath. Okay, for conclusion, living things need air to breathe. Okay, living things need air to breathe. All right, let's move for our next topic. All right, moving air. Okay, what is moving air? Moving air is known as a wind. Wind cannot be seen but can be felt. So, do you know that the wind affect human in many ways? How the wind help humans? Look for conversation between two different situation here. Cyphel, the wind is blowing. This is the best time to fly a kite. The wind helps kite to fly high. Mom, how does the sailing boat move? The wind moves the sailing boat. So for conclusion here, the wind can fly a kite and also can move a sailing boat. Alright. What is the effect of strong winds? Okay, the strong wind causes a big wave. Okay, cause a big wave. Alright, that's all for our lesson today. See you for the next lesson. Thank you.